I'm calm and I'm running to be Student Union President this year. If I were to be elected President, I would fight to raise awareness of mental illnesses. I believe that anxiety, depression and stress can be a big problem for students, with most, if not all of these, all students having been through or currently going through one of these problems. I think we need to work together to increase knowledge of mental health issues so that students know how to deal with it if they're going through it themselves, or so they can help others who are going through it as well. I suggest that we introduce specific days dedicated to raising awareness of mental health issues. These days will include special events that are run and set up by students as well as welcoming guest speakers and helpful resources with live music to create an atmosphere where all students feel relaxed and able to ask questions. Also, I think there should be a group every week that is run by students who receive special training that offers support and help to other students that are going through mental health issues. Additionally, I will promote awareness of people with physical and learning disabilities. I believe that, like the mental health campaign, there should be special days dedicated to raising awareness of both these issues. For people with physical disabilities, I believe there should be a review to the facilities available to them, such as elevators and toilet facilities, to ensure that they offer the best possible facilities to help them and suit their needs. Also, I think there should be given more opportunities to volunteer doing jobs within the college, such as working in the CAF, and they should be given the, the appropriate equipment to do so. And for people with learning disabilities, I also think they should be given opportunities to take part in mainstream jobs within the college. This will give the students an opportunity to advance their life skills and get equal opportunities in the real world. Also, I believe that they should get more of a chance to organise charitable events with other students from around the college. And this will give all students the opportunity to mix together and socialise with people they wouldn't usually work with. Another issue that I would focus on is the fact that there are students in this college who are going hungry because their families cannot afford food to feed them. I suggest that we offer free meals for students who are seen to be going hungry at home and I believe the staff and students need to be more diligent to see anyone who is in need and they should raise the issue with the students union if they see anyone. Additionally, I think that we could raise awareness of charities available to them such as the food banks and I also think there should be a box in each campus where, food, where people can donate food to the food banks which should involve more students in the charity. And my final suggestion is that we should look at improving the overall feel of the college. To do this I think there should be better sane systems with a radio station playing within every single cafe of each campus. I think there should be more social areas with seating and music where people can chill out and relax and socialise together. Additionally I suggest that we have more special events to celebrate dates in the calendar such as St George's Day and other cultural events so that we can celebrate the cultural diversity of Dudley College. I believe that we should have more special events with live music that are organised by students to give students the opportunity to show their skills. And I believe you should vote for me because I feel that I can lead a team responsibly and effectively as well as organising and mobilising members of a team to get jobs done to improve college life for you, the students. I have already proved this by setting up a Christian Union back in February this year and mobilising and stabilising a group that is available to all. I promise that I will fight to do what is right for the students of this college and I believe that if we work together and use our voices we will ensure that we have the best possible life at college. And I promise I will fight to serve you in the best way I can to deliver the change that you want to see in this college. Thank you. Hi, I'm Dan Wood and I'm running for my second and final year to be your Student Union President. And my three key aims in my manifesto are these. Mental health progression of students, and political engagement. So, what do I want to do with mental health? Well, I want to continue raising the awareness of mental health, but not just among students, but among staff as well. And how can we achieve this? Well, I'd like to keep inviting external organisations in to promote their services to the students, and external speakers to educate students on the different issues that affect them.
I'd also like to do a round table where this would allow us to gather the main issues that students face and this allows us to target our work more effectively to help deal with those issues. I also want to see a food bank not just run in December but throughout the year. Yes, it was nice at Christmas, but I think it would be more effective to run it throughout the year as well. And also, uh, for the progression of students, I want to be able to continue to actually set up the volunteer framework that we began to do work on this year. So we're able to promote external organisations, volunteer opportunities. But we also want to ensure that when you, the students, go to volunteer, that you're rewarded for what you've put in. The hours that you put in, say 25, 50 hours, we want to ensure that it's rewarded through a certificate system of bronze, silver, gold. And this then helps you to build your CV, your skills and your life. That's a very key point. I also want to do a progression week where we do various classes on money and time management, CV building, interview techniques, and then this will help you with your next step to go on after college. Far too often, students don't know what they want to do once they finish their course. Downward wants to help tackle that. And for political engagement, I want to increase the strength of our political engagement drive throughout the college by delivering political classes to help educate students on what Parliament actually is, how government works, what parties are there, and the actual power of voting. And I think if we can increase students' knowledge on all of these areas, we can increase the amount of young voters that actually vote. Thank you for listening. Hi everyone, I'm Naila. After thinking long and hard, I decided to enroll into adult education in September last year to gain more experience and meet new people. I am currently a student welfare officer. This year I've decided to stand for the role of student governor because I am a very confident person and I also believe I have a level of maturity required in such a high level role. And my aim is to listen to students and help in the best way I can and become the united voice for students and stakeholders. Merci! Hi, my name is Stephen Bennett. I am running for the position of student governor. The main reason I'm interested in this position is so I can put the interests of the students at the top level. I think I will be good for the position because I'm a confident person who likes to make myself heard. I'm also a patient person so I will listen to everyone's point of view. If there is something I disagree with, I will make sure the relevant person knows my feelings. Also, this can help me bridge the gap between the students and the people at the top in this college. <laughs>